If your car feels sluggish, has poor throttle response, or the engine revs erratically, your throttle position sensor, TPS, could be to blame. The good news? You don't need to visit a mechanic just yet. In this video, we'll show you three easy ways to reset your TPS, including a basic ignition reset, a battery disconnect method, and a TPS reprogramming technique for more persistent problems. By following these simple steps, you can save time and money and help keep your car running smoothly, efficiently, and responsively. Step 1. Basic Ignition Reset This is the simplest and most common method. It works well for most modern vehicles, especially if your throttle feels off. Here's how to do it. But you don't see any warning lights or error codes. 1. Turn off the engine and make sure your vehicle is safely parked. 2. Insert your key into the ignition and turn it to the on position, but don't start the engine. You should see the dashboard light up, which is normal. 3. Slowly press the gas pedal all the way to the floor. This should take about 4 seconds. 4. Once the pedal is fully depressed, hold it down for 3 seconds. 5. Then, slowly release the pedal over another 4 seconds. 6. Repeat this press hold release sequence 2 more times, for a total of 3 cycles. 7. After the third cycle, turn the ignition off and remove the key. 8. Wait for 10 seconds to allow the system to reset. 9. Finally, insert the key again and start the engine. Pay attention to how your throttle feels. If the response is smoother and the idle is steady, your TPS reset was successful. Step 2. Battery Disconnect Reset If the ignition method didn't work, don't worry. This next method gives your vehicle a more complete electrical reset and is especially helpful for cars with electronic throttle control. Here's how to do it. 1. Again, make sure your car is turned off and parked securely. 2. Open the hood and locate the battery. 3. Use a wrench to loosen and disconnect. The negative battery cable, the black one. Be careful not to let the cable touch any metal. 4. Once disconnected, leave the battery terminal unplugged for 5 to 10 minutes. This gives your car's electrical systems time to fully discharge and reset. 5. After waiting, reconnect the negative terminal and tighten it securely. 6. Insert the key and turn it to the on position without starting the engine. Let the dash lights run their checks. 7. Now, start the engine, but don't touch the gas pedal. 8. Let the engine idle for 10 to 15 minutes. This gives the ECU time to recalibrate the throttle settings. 9. Turn the engine off, then start it again. If your throttle response has improved and the idle is steady, the reset worked. If this video helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more practical car maintenance tips.